Come on, Crypto. Good boy, dog. We had a loose dog come up to us just now. He got the rollerblades on. Oh. One thing I like about rollerblades is the fact that you can jump over stuff. People really love the rollerblades. It's not the easiest to master. I just figured might as well do something different. So I pulled out the rollerblades. If you're looking to rollerblade with your dog, it could be really difficult. I would recommend for your dog to know how to mush first or else you're gonna have a really hard time. Maybe if I hang on to him. This is awkwardly working. All right, we Gucci. We Gucci. I'm gonna put him on the leash. Yeah, he swam. I'm telling you, hey. Crypto. Hey, sit down. Sit down. Sit. Tell him, all right. Mm -hmm. Sit down. Sit. Good boy. Let's go to the other bench. Where? Over there. Yeah. All right. Let's go. <laughs> if he lets him go, he's gonna come back. That's a fact. Did he say anything? Cause you no. kicked him off. No, I wasn't kicking him. I was just pushing him off. I wouldn't kick him. Fuck that. It's too fucked up. Glory. Yesterday? Yesterday? Yeah. Look at Archie. And I told him to sit. Oh yeah? yeah? Nah, my ass. Call him. Archie, come here. Ooh. Dang. I see right. you. Well, let's see what right actually goes. Okay, he's a few hundred. Look at that obedience Ooh. training. Yeah, I was like, I'm like, <laughs> Sky! Oh, try to jump on me, baby. Oh, you whore. Come on. Hello. Hello. Just when you guys thought Milo couldn't get any fruitier, we put a bandana on his ass. Let's go. What is up, YouTube? And welcome to another Crib Zone excursion. If you guys enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit that thumbs up, subscribe for more. Stop acting fruity, Milo. I finally used this long enough to actually do a review on it. It smells like medicine. Now for all of you guys that haven't seen this product on my channel, this is Musher's Paw Wax. It's meant to protect the dog's paws. Today, I will be reviewing this product. I put this on all of my dogs. It does a really good job protecting their paws. There was this one time I showered him and I didn't apply the paw wax and he was actually complaining to me about the ground. The cracks, this really makes a dog's paws super soft, like a baby's butt. I've been using this for about two months, I would say. This is the 60 gram one. There is a bigger one. This was around $20, including shipping. Before I bought this, I did try to buy him some boots. It turned out really bad. The boots just came off flying before I left the block. 100% natural waxes. Applying this once a week will be really generous. We're supposed to be making a video. Applying this is pretty easy. A thin layer is all you need, otherwise you'll just be wasting it. In the beginning, your dog might be really ticklish. As soon as they notice the benefits, because your dog will notice the benefits. If you do exercise your dog a lot, this product is a must.
you can really tell the difference from a dog that has paw wax and a dog that doesn't. Crypto's paws are extremely soft. This paw wax protects from hot surfaces, snow. I do believe it's water resistant. You could really tell if your dog's paw still has the wax on them. You don't really want to over exaggerate and put a lot. As soon as your dog steps, he'll probably remove all the excess wax. This paw wax also moisturizes their paws. Their paws is their only way of transportation, so we have to take care of our dog's paws. It's always good to make sure your dog's paws are protected. They do like licking it. This is safe for your dog. They could actually eat it. They do like to taste stuff. So what I like to do is I always grab some and put some on his nose. Even though you should correct it, don't let him lick it. This is my go-to product for my dog's paw protection. I'll throw the link down in the description. Make sure you guys buy this. There is, I believe it's 100 grams, so it's a bigger one. If you do have a lot of dogs, that's the better option for you. This isn't just for big dogs. This is for any and every dog out there. Look into Musher's Paw Wax. It's a really good product that I have been personally using for a really long time and I could strongly recommend to anybody looking to protect their dog's paws. Oh, the rat. Oh, damn. Probably haven't applied this in, in probably two weeks. You could really see how crusty his paws are. This goes all deep inside all of those cracks and it protects the paws. Boom, just like that, all his paws are covered in wax. Those paws look freaking minty fresh. I don't even know what this is. Let's just add some to it. Wow, it's so crusty. Ooh. You need some lotion, dog. After applying the paw wax, leave your dog laying down. Let it slightly dry up. How am I though? <laughs> so fruity. I can guarantee you that your dog will appreciate you using the paw wax. If you're looking to protect your dog's paws, this is the product you guys want. I'll throw the link down in the description. This 60 gram will probably last you half a year. You can tell when your dog needs new paw wax. We have to make sure we protect their paws. This product gets two thumbs up. Here to buy some headphones. I double laced the shoelace. Hopefully he stays in frame more. <laughs> 20 bucks, 50 bucks. Let's just get these. What happens? Your blood pressure on Team NoFab. Oh, there you go. Hey. Can't go. What are you for here? Bounce. What the fuck? Bro, I can't. There. It's about to come out. Bro, I, I for real came from the people. Bro. Audio on a 2005 Suzuki DRZ. 